Ten billion bucks for it. Yeah, I don't know why people get rid of these handicap lifts. I think it makes a nice balcony. At least not in this town. This would seem to be a little bit higher than most. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I like it. I think it makes a great patio. Or a deck, or whatever you want to call it. A balcony. But yeah. This is the pleasure of a bus life. If you ain't doing bus life, you should. Or. Many ways of doing it. I feel this is a good way. Living in the middle of congestion, this, I don't know so much about that. Living in the middle of nowhere, I don't know so much about all that. This is about as the middle of nowhere as I want to get. But like I say, I'm only about 20, 30 minutes out of Manhattan. And then once I'm in there, I'm only minutes away from, ooh, everything. But, see what I like about my It allows me this million dollar waterfront of property. Now these people got nice houses, and they got nice little porches on the front of them, and they're very really sweet. But they got to pay a lot more money than me. And then every year, they probably got to pay in taxes what I pay for this whole rig. <laughs> so, yeah. When you don't got it, you can still get it. You just gotta think in and outside the box at the same time. But anyway, I'm making it work for money and I say all the good people in the world can make it work for them too. In New York City right here. Staten Island. Kinda known as Princess Bay. And there's a little thing over here, there's Lemon Creek that goes back over there. The boat's all tied up in there. New Jersey in addition to the horizon, you know, New Jersey. Anyway. And I'll be here two, three nights and then I'll be gone and the neighbors love me. They bring me food. <laughs> what are you going to do? I take your one it, but you gotta take it. Say thank you very much. But maybe some people need it. So those of you out there that want to bring food, keep bringing it. <laughs> hmm. I love bus uh, Oh yeah. This bug spray thing here. You know. Is three gallon bug spray. In the summertime, I don't think you need much more than that to take showers. You get one of those nozzles with the, uh, the sink to spray your dishes with the mobile ones set on it. off and in certain places you could put the deck out and step out onto this thing and just let the water drain right through yeah you could even put a a little uh, privacy thing around it wouldn't matter where or when in my opinion yeah but in the winter time you gotta come up with a different plan but in the summer time you really don't need a shower shower inside the boat and in the winter are you really going to use it? Anyway, that's just a conundrum for people who are considering doing this. And I think you'll find out you very rarely use your indoor shower. Unless you're a serious commitment, you got a hot water heater too. But you could paint that black and put it out in the sun all half a day. And when you want to take a warm shower, you could. But in the summertime, you actually want to cool off. Or I could go swim and then come back and shower off. Yeah, it works. It works really good for me. Anyway, it's like uh, an indoor-outdoor 
inside or outside the tip for all the school bus people who want to take the short way to the short bus living. That's my solution to my problem. Yeah, I got uh, memberships to the fitnesses for the other times I need to take showers. That's how that works. Yeah, and there's a porta potty back there. But anyway, that's no big deal. We don't even want to talk about that subject. But anyway, it's all covered, but I don't think that's a subject for YouTube. <laughs> that's just personal. But anyway, isn't what my life is all about? Step. Yeah. What's right? On the outpost. All my wonderful YouTube people enjoy your every moment of wickedness life. Peace, everybody. Just me and Joanna.